Hey guys, so I am back with another video. I want to first apologize for the fact that I have not uploaded anything in two weeks, maybe? I don't know, that's bad. Uh, the reason behind that is because a couple weeks ago I reorganized my room, so I moved everything around, and at the time when I had first um, had the new setup, I did not have anywhere that I felt was a good enough place to film. I know that sounds really ridiculous, but it's just something where I didn't like the setup and I didn't like the way it looked and I knew that I wasn't going to like uh, the video. So I reorganized it again and then this past week I was on spring break and I pretty much just laid around and did nothing so I did not record. So with that being said, this video is basically going to be how to style, different ways to style an army jacket for spring. Spring is kind of an awkward transition stage from winter into summer, especially in Alabama because some days it can be super duper hot and some days it can be kind of on the cool side. So I do like to kind of just throw on this as a little bit of a layer just in case I get cold because even if it's like 80 degrees outside I will end up getting cold at like nighttime because you know the sun's not out to literally burn your flesh. So this video is going to show you guys just a couple of ways that I like to uh, style an army jacket for spring transitioning into summer uh, because an army jacket for me has kind of become like a signature statement in my wardrobe. The obsession with army jackets kind of came whenever I started watching Freaks and Geeks and it's now in my favorite shows but every time I saw Lindsay wearing this army jacket I was like oh my I think it looks freaking awesome. Okay so before I continue to ramble on let's just go ahead and show the outfits. Mm -hmm. 